Your card is only on CBS 46 and tonight a Metro Atlanta buffet is busted after the health department says that workers tried to grab a container of food from an outside dumpster. Yikes. But before we dish out those dirty details, our Adam Murphy gets things started at a family owned Cuban restaurant with a perfect score. <laughs> Bienvenidos! Cuban is on the menu on this week's restaurant report card. We're at Lazaro's right here in the heart of historic Roswell. They've been here nearly eight years. It's inside this old home. It's got so much character when you come in. The artwork straight out of Cuba. They got a top health score and the food. Well, it's authentic and I'll tell you why. Laz himself is from Cuba and he's back there cooking up delicious entrees for you. Many of which I'm going to tell you about in a moment. But first, here's this week's. Best and worst scores. Were you dumpster diving? No one saw this question coming. Not even the manager of a popular buffet in Clayton County. City Buffet on Highway 85 in Riverdale failed with 56 points in a U for unsatisfactory. The report says there were flies in the kitchen, ants at the mop sink, and gnats near the hibachi station. Plus, employees attempted to save unsafe fried chicken by placing it in a car parked out back and an employee jumped inside the dumpster to remove a container and then return to the kitchen. We dump the chicken wing to the container. The container fall into the dumpster. We just get the containers back to be washed. But shouldn't you just leave that dirty container in the dumpster? Yes, this is, yeah, our, the peop, our people make stuff, make a violation, make a mistake. To make matters worse, management attempted to hide their violations by posting the wrong health score. Ridiculous. I live in this community. It's not fair to the people that live here and that support you. You had a 91A up there, and I just took a picture of it. You really had a 56U or something? What was that, a 56? No, I, 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 Let me have my money, sir. There's no way I would eat this food. You know, when dumps are diving. The manager immediately issued refunds to a group of concerned customers. I know you. I can tell your face. I can tell his face. I can tell their face. I apologize to let you down, but really, we are making improvement step by step. And here at Lazaro's Cuban Cuisine in the heart of historic Roswell, they received a 100 on their last health inspection. Congratulations, they are the winner of this week's Golden Spatula Award. Everything coming out of that kitchen hot and fresh, authentic ingredients. So let's get right to the menu. Over here they have the skirt steak with the rice. You can get the empanadas on the menu. They have pork with the grilled onions and rice. That's a favorite at the restaurant as well. Black beans to go along with it for dessert. Their pastries are made right here in house. So you know they're good as well. And how about the Cuban sandwich? A little sangria to wash it down. That's what I'm going with. We'll see you all next week. And their sauces are also homemade. Boy, that's good.